As you begin your science project, it would be a really good idea to find a mentor that can help you through the process. It's just nice to have somebody there that can help support you, encourage you, answer questions. Also, it's a really good idea to form a science club. It just is very simple. You can just get together two or three other students that are also creating science fair projects. And it's just great to get together once in a while and talk about your ideas and share them, bounce them off them. And, and a lot of times they can give you great ideas on how to change it just a little bit, make it a little more complicated, a little more interesting. So I highly recommend that you try to find somebody, you know, lock arms and go through the process with them. It can be very simple. You can meet once a month or you can meet, um, you know, more often. Just having that accountability, having someone that is in there with you makes a really big difference. The second thing I'd like to talk about is doing a team project versus an individual project. Now a team project is different than having a science club. That means you're actually doing the project with another student. The thing to keep in mind with a team project is it's expected to be twice as complicated, or it should be. And so you need to bring two different components into it where you're bringing the skills of both students. So you're not there just to share the work on, you know, a, a lower level project. Look for something that's more complicated where you can bring the two of you together. Either way is fine, individual projects or team projects. It just depends on your style. Um, another thing about mentors, if you um, are looking for mentors, a good place to start looking is parents. They're, they don't have to be scientific or um, experts in any, in any area. There are a lot of components of a science fair project that your parents would be prob probably some of the most willing people to help you through your science project. If You can also look for uh, teachers that are able to help or scientists or engineers in your area, friends, family, uh, relatives. Also, uh, if you need an expert in a specific area that you're studying, for your science project, it you can um, call local universities, local colleges. Sometimes they have students studying in a certain area and they would be happy to meet with you for a little while and once in a while you can get a professor that will meet with you for an hour or so. Also, um, you can co contact local labs and um, or labs at the university and see if they will allow you to come in for a short period of time to work on your project.